Tripwire Interactive. They are a gaming company, and well, the decision that they made here to oust their CEO, absolutely disgusting, simply stating his support for the new Texas Heartbeat Law. We're gonna get into all the details of this, guys. First, if you could, please like this video, share it, hit the bell, subscribe, and wear the glasses because I'm blind. So it was last Friday, September the 3rd, the CEO of Tripwire Interactive, John Gibson, he took to social media to voice his support for the new Texas Heartbeat Law. And he actually said that, you know, this isn't something that I normally do. I'm not one who's usually political, but I figured that since there were so many that were vocal on the left about this issue, that I would come out and I would voice my support for the fact that I am completely behind the Supreme Court standing up for Texas and allowing the new heartbeat law to go into effect. He says, I'm a, I'm not just a, you know, a, a game creator, but I'm also someone who, you know, respects the lives of the little ones. And I want to see the little ones protected. Now that post got so much backlash from people. And I don't, I mean, maybe he knew that going in, but just the people, and I've said before, just the demons in hell right now, they have, they're, they're all over this this earth right now, especially all over the country, and they are raging. Their fists are clenched. They're gnashing their teeth because they don't want the little ones protected. They never have. And this law right here is going to set some precedent that could just spread throughout the rest of the country. So you see why they're going to fight so hard. It took a couple days later. It was actually on Labor Day, on the 6th, that Tripwire Interactive, they come out with a statement of their own in regards to what Gibson had to say and his position on defending Texas's decision. And well, they were completely against what he said. And we're gonna get into their statement in just a second, guys. But first, if you could, consider making a generous donation here to our ministry. If you guys are blessed by the daily video content we put out here talking about end time Bible prophecy headlines and trying to get people to Jesus Christ, your generosity can help us out in a major way down below. With us being demonetized here especially, we have PayPal or Patreon down below. Even just five bucks a month on Patreon gets you bonus content. Also, we include the links to the YouTube videos to make sure you get all the alerts when the new content arrives. You can also comment there, censorship free, avoid YouTube blocking what you guys are saying. You can send me direct messages. It's a great way to just keep in contact with everything that I'm doing. You could also, guys, big reminder, sub to me on Rumble. That's our backup in case we're kicked off of YouTube. We already post there. So go check us out. All those links are down below. Again, a big thank you to everybody already contributing to the ministry. And for those of you thinking about doing so, Thank you as well, and God bless you for it. But Tripwire's statement, coming out and condemning Gibson, saying that his views do not reflect the views of Tripwire Interactive as a whole. They said he did not take into account the feelings that the other staff members had when he came out here with his statement, which there was nothing wrong with, by the way. The guy was just simply defending the new law, the fact that he wants to defend the little ones. What's so wrong about that? But Tripwire made it seem like he, he went on social media and just said the most just incredibly disgusting things you could possibly say, which wasn't the case. And they said that here at Tripwire, we want everybody to feel valued. This hurts some of the feelings of some of the staff here and that we are trying to foster a more positive environment. I mean, when I saw that, I'm like a, a more positive environment. How, what, what, is, what is going to be more positive than what Texas has already done? I mean, what what world do you live in? If if what Gibson said was not positive, then in your mind, in a, you know, Tripwire Interactive, what is positive to you? I, I, just disgusting comments here. So they said that because of that, Gibson has now, well, stepped down. Well, he was fired. Let's just face it. They tried to make it seem like he resigned, but he's gone now for simply stating his views, and the VP is now taking over as the interim CEO as Tripwire moves forward to be more inclusive and more accepting of people's feelings, except if you're on the side that they're against. That's what the left has always been about. This was actually met with backlash on the other side, people on the right coming out against Tripwire Interactive, saying, who are you to try and cancel somebody, try and fire somebody because they don't line up with your views? But then there was actually some that even though they disagreed with the Texas law, they actually defended Gibson and said that, look, I don't agree with Gibson, but do I think that he needs to be losing his job? No, I think that's a little weird, to be honest with you. We shouldn't be doing that. Well, thankfully, there's still some sensible people. And yes, they can have a disagreement with somebody, but they don't just think that they deserve to have their livelihood taken from them. 
The other funny thing is that apparently there's going to be this town hall that Tripwire is going to have where they're going to encourage a dialogue between you know the other staff members and try to open up discussions for opposing viewpoints. Yeah, how'd that work out for Gibson? Uh, these people are, are completely gone. They are out of their mind. They need prayer is what they need. And let's hope, speaking of that, that uh, God will bless Mr. John Gibson here with something even better than the position that he held with Tripwire Interactive because he took a stand for these little ones. And I believe God will honor that and anybody else, you know, especially uh, those in the legislature of Texas that, that signed this, the governor that signed it into law. I believe that God will, will honor them for that. I do. Uh, but those that oppose that and those that work against that, God will deal with you. You will be judged for it. And as I mentioned earlier, this is why we do these videos as we talk about the prophetic news headlines around the world. Because Jesus Christ is coming back soon. We're trying to get people to him. Maybe you're one of those people. You have not received Christ as Savior. We want to give you this opportunity to do that right now. You can do this prayer in your own words. I'll give you the steps that you need in order to make that possible. The first thing that you want to do is acknowledge that you're a sinner. Something that we all are. But God gave his only son, Jesus Christ, to die on the cross for the sins of all the world. He died and rose again for you and me. He paid the cost. What you have to do, though, is that you have to repent of your sin. Repent means to turn from your sin, not just to say you're sorry, but to turn from a lifestyle, a habit, whatever it is in your life that's counter to what the Word of God says. You ask Jesus to forgive you, he'll wipe that sin away. The Bible says he won't remember it any longer. And then you invite Jesus into your life to be your Lord and Savior. When you do that, you become born again, a child of God. You will have eternal life. Trust me when I tell you there is no greater decision you will ever make than the one you do to give your life to Christ. I pray that you make that decision today. I'll have more for you guys on this down below. You can read the full statements from both Gibson and Tripwire Interactive. Don't forget the links to donate to our ministry are there as well. It is a great blessing if you can help us out. Thank you all so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you. And I'll talk with you soon.